hi guys welcome back to our hair channel um, today we're gonna do we're gonna be taking care of Bree's hair and I say today but honestly it's night guys this is why the lighting here is so ridiculous but I have to do her hair right now because we're heading out um, tomorrow and they're gonna be in the water swimming because we're going on a little mini vacay before the summer is done it's a daycation really but perfect so this is what our hair is looking like I just took it out it's been in sections, but I can't detangle it at the current moment just because it's just so much hair. So what we're gonna do, going to deep condition using this olive oil professional, what's it called? Replenishing conditioner, because I feel like her hair is in dire need of some hydration. And we're gonna be using this um, tea tree oil, argan oil. Can, uh, is this a conditioner as well? I didn't realize this was a conditioner. I thought this was a shampoo. I, I picked this up thinking it was a shampoo, but it was actually a conditioner. So now back to the drawing board. I'll be right back. So the shampoo of choice that we chose to use is this Tresemme one. It is one of our all-time favorites. We like it because it is actually really um, moisturizing for the hair and it is rather relatively inexpensive. So that is what we used. Now I'm on to basically wash her hair. Now her hair is a little bit tangled. I should have probably used a pre-poo, but honestly guys, I've got four kids. Life is just busy. So I do just kind of go right in. Her hair wasn't too tangled, but as you can see, I'm actually squirting the shampoo onto the roots of her hair. And I, because I don't want it to be all over the um, ends of her hair yet until I wash, you know, the roots. So I find also with her scalp is that the build up her anything that I put on her hair gets built up really quickly and so if I don't um, scrub her scalp well enough that it can still have build up on it um, secondly it looks like I am being very rough but I'm not y'all I mean I fast forward this video so you can see it and it's a little you know it's everything looks just a little harsher but it's not she survived and she's good um, so that's what we're doing and I keep applying more and more shampoo just to get the lather on the scalp that I want to achieve. And then I will move along down to the shaft, um, just down to the ends of the hair. Also, you guys may notice that I am doing one side of the hair. Generally, I like to even part it into four sections if I have enough time, but honestly, it was night. I was tired and I am just doing my best to focus on one side. I'm just praying that, you know what, the conditioner's gonna save me after. Um, look at that Tresemme shampoo in the background, peeking out like I'm getting paid for this advertisement. Mm -hmm. So before I move on, I just wanna show you the conditioner that I was using. Guys, I somehow picked this up. I read what I, I read everything, tea tree and argan oil, but I thought it was a shampoo. Anyways, it's a conditioner, so I did proceed to use this in her hair. And then I'm going to show you guys the results. Stay tuned for it because I was actually impressed. So here, after I've already applied the conditioner, I basically let it sit on their hair for, for on her hair for a little bit. And as you can see, I am just going through it and trying to detangle it. At this point, I have already detangled the bottom, working my way up. And now I'm just trying to brush it out up at the roots and ensure that I can go through it. And as you can see, uh, you know, the glide is real. I am able to get my fingers through it, not to mention the comb or the brush. Whatever tool I am using right here is sliding through her hair really quickly without any issues. Now, um, she's needing to get a clip. I definitely need to get on that because we need her hair to be healthy and all that jazz. But as you guys can see, I'm going to show you guys a closer look here to let you see just what we started off with. And as you can see, I am, from time to time, you can see that I am starting at the top a little bit. And it's because um, the root, the ends are already kind of detangled. And it's usually just the top part where her hair was caught up with like a hair tie, where it's just the, the worst part. And so you can see me starting up there. But one thing I don't do, I don't tug it all the way through. I try to not break her hair. That's not good. So... You guys can see, but she had a ton of dead hair trapped in there just because her hair was in a protective style for a little bit. And yeah, this is what we started off with. And in like two seconds, y'all are going to see exactly where we reached. And I have to say, I am pretty darn impressed by this new product. And if I can get my hands on it again, I definitely will because I could not find, I didn't find it in like the beauty supply store. I actually came by it in winners of all places, y'all. 
winners. So as you guys can see here, her hair is looking nice and silky and smooth. And the Tangle Tamer is brushing through easily. At some point, I even used the comb. I hope y'all are seeing it in this footage. But I used the wide tooth comb. And you can see her hair is actually curling and just everything. You can just tell that it's super hydrated and detangled, which is exactly what I want. Now, I ended up just leaving this product to sit on her hair for about 10 minutes. And surprisingly, it worked really well. I was experimenting because I know it says conditioner, but... You know, I, I always try to experiment a little bit and see how long I can, can leave a product on and just to see what it does. And this is what it, it did. Now, I'm, I have to say when I did rinse it out, like her hair still felt super moisturized, but I honestly didn't want to rinse it out because it just, it wasn't obviously the same after all the conditioner was kind of, you know, washed out. But I feel like if I were to do use it to a little bit of this to make it like a leave-in conditioner it you know I might be on to something so we'll see how that goes but I definitely want to do a quick review on this product to show you my thoughts on it and to show you just how it worked in um, Gabrielle's hair so comment down below and let me know if you've ever used this product this Lacetta tea tree and argan oil conditioner it says it clarifies and repairs and it is safe for colored hair as well so um, yeah, guys, let me know what your thoughts are on that. Uh, I'm definitely going to be trying it on my other girl's hair. Uh, Michaela, who did a video before, she uses this on her hair, and she said she's really liking it, and she's seeing a difference on it. So, um, I don't know. Let me know your thoughts, and hope you guys enjoyed this little mini update. Thanks for watching, y'all. Much love. We can mm -hmm. have size day, and we can all do reading. Yep. So guys, this is what it turned what her hair looks like. As you can see, Mick, Mick. As you can see, it parts really easily. And it's due to this product. This is our first time using this. So it's a tea tree and argan oil conditioner. 